All right, thanks for your time today. Um, Odette, so tell me about Dr. Jessica Adams and how does she come into the show? And I'm guessing there's, you know, there's always fun interaction with the new recruits with House. Yeah, absolutely. You meet her uh, during the season premiere, and she's a prison doctor. That's how she meets House at the prison. Uh, she comes from a very wealthy family. She comes from a lot of money, so she doesn't have to work if she doesn't want to. So that says a lot about her character that she chooses to work at the prison. She's a very, very smart girl. She went to the best medical school basically you can go to. Um, so she's a do-gooder and uh, she's very idealistic. She's very opinionated and much like House and I think this is why they have, you know, a great connection when you meet them is because she loves the puzzle and, and finding, you know, the diagnosis just as much as House does. Okay. And Charlene, we know a lot of your work from the comedy field. Is that kind of what you bring to the show as well? Um, hopefully, at points. Um, I, I feel like there's comedy be between the dynamic between House and Dr. G. Park. That's my character. Mm -hmm. um, G. That's such a funny name. <laughs> no offense to anyone named that. It's just, I've never heard that name. But um, I think because my character is kind of like this uptight, like, grounded fireball of emotion and um, he thinks that's amusing so he kind of picks up my character to try to get that to come out and so I think um, hopefully there's humor between that as intended in the script. Okay. There is, by the way. Okay, excellent. And you know, you guys I assume are fans, fans of the show, so did you have some preconceived notion of what he would be like on set or what it would be like to interact with everybody you've been watching all these years? Yeah, I, I feel like you can't help but to associate the character with the person. You know, you would think, you know, he's so much like his character because he plays it so well. But, I mean, it's just a testament to Hugh and how great of an actor he is because he really is just such a lovely man and he's so great to work with and he's really just, you know, he's wonderful, right? He's, uh... He's very funny, he's very charming, and he's making us feel as comfortable as we can coming into a, a brand new situation with characters that have been working together for years and years. So we're very thankful for that. Yeah, Charlene, did you have some preconceived notions of what it would be like? No, I had no idea what to expect. But um, I think uh, he was actually saying how surprised he was of how, like, like, hey there, buddy, like, excited to meet him. He's like, I thought I was intimidating. <laughs> I was like, I used to, I was intimidating, too, until someone said I was cute. And I was like, that's, what? Sh shut. Shut you your are face. cute. <laughs> and so, so far, have you mostly been <laughs> working with you, or have you been working with some of the other actors? We've worked with everybody, um, but we, we have, I, I definitely have specifically worked with Hugh and Ms. Chi Park. Uh, we've got a really great dynamic. I mean, it's 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 going to be interesting to see the new team versus the old team and see how sort of that plays together because you've got the old team that is so used to uh, House's character and so used to how he deals with, you know, medicine and, you know, uh, his team. And then we're sort of seeing everything for the first time and, you know, we're sort of the eyes for the audience. And, you know, there's a bit of that shock value with how he does treat. Um, so it'll be it'll be great to see how that plays. Okay. And the show also always has great guest stars. Any new guest stars you've worked with so far yet? We uh, were able to work with the great Wentworth Miller. He uh, He's going to be a guest star on one of the upcoming episodes, and it was so wonderful to work with him. You know, we unfortunately, poor thing, I mean, we had to test out, you know, it was sort of like our trial run and doing procedures and, you know, sort of yeah. that whole thing. And so hopefully he forgives us for, <laughs> you know. I had to do something with the thing near his leg, and he pretended like I accidentally stabbed him. I'm, this was in front of everyone while rehearsing. I was just like, oh, so sorry. <laughs> He's like, calm down. <laughs> he was a great sport. Yeah. And, you know, it's we're very excited to have him. Okay. And Odette, obviously, Breaking In's coming back. Mm -hmm. Do you know how you're going to juggle both? both jobs at this point? I don't know how I'm going to juggle both of them, but I am ready and willing to do that. I love uh, both shows, and I love both characters, and, you know, if if it could ever happen, which I'm sure it won't, but I keep pitching that breaking in should break into House's office, and then, you know, my character, Melanie, can battle off with, you know, Dr. Adams, and then I wouldn't have a scheduling conflict, and then it would all work out. But that would be having my cake and eating it, too. So I don't know. We'll that see. Could, that could be fun, though. It could Crossover be. Crossover, maybe. Yeah. All right. We'll see. <laughs> well, thanks so much for your time. Can't wait to see the new season. Thank you. Thanks.